till now we have discussed the various reasons for the causes of the global warming climatic changes the anthropology the human made mistakes or the deforestation what is ipcc doing on all these things now what is the impact of this why we have to address this issue very seriously because it started influencing on the indian land also now see the impact of the climate change what does it bring major changes for us it does not look much serious like the temperatures are averagely have raised for only 2 degrees celsius when the average temperatures have raised for 2 degrees celsius do we generally feel like from 38 it went to 40 or from 40 it went to 42 it does not bring much variation for us it is an average temperature raise means it is not only 2 degrees it may be 4 degrees or it may be 5 degrees like that when it is in the average it is 2 degrees and one more thing is when the average 2 degrees have raised the sea levels have raised to 1 meter above the normal level so 1 meter above to the normal level the all the coastal areas were influenced by this and when the isla tufan which came in 2009 isla super cyclone which has occurred in 2009 many of the families which are in the eastern part of kolkata have lost their houses and many thunderstorms the people the policemen have used the kolkata metropolitan development authority has used a bulldozer to shut down the houses because of thunderstorms and which are very nearby to the coastal areas may be influenced and fell down into the things we have seen in tsunami 2011 the houses are floating on that so the water impact may be very heavy the forces and when it comes to a super cyclone like isla where the winds are with very heavy winds and forces people are forcefully evacuated from that place and many of the people like 700 to 800 families were rendered homeless and they spent many sleepless nights to get secured from this cyclones these all are some of the examples of the experiences or impacts of the climatic changes and this climate change does not occur only in kolkata region or in some other regions once it starts influencing it is a global phenomena it starts to influence in the entire world or in the entire globe and the himalayas once they start to melt they already started melting in some regions in the polar region the ice caps are melting so the globally the water levels will increase up the fishermen will get disturbance in his life and automatically the coastal areas are becoming less they get submerged into the land we have the indira sub point getting submerged for us in the 2004 tsunami for us so like that it is a global phenomena and nobody will be left out of it so everybody should take it seriously and address the issue the ipcc should concentrate seriously and all the government should think of the entire globe rather than only thinking about their own countries so that our countries will be safe even the climatic changes and the safety measures should be taken